Hello guys, and today I am at the Denver Broncos, and this is a divisional round rematch from last year, and in the longest, and one of the best classic games I've had in this franchise, as it was a long game, as as it just seemed to never end and this could be a possible playoff preview once again I mean I mean the Broncos lead in their division and I don't really lead in mine but I'm still going strong at 62 and the Broncos at 5 and 3 and so I will have my commentating now As after the Jeremy Diaz run, the Titans set up at, the, at their own 34-yard line. Second down and seven. Freeman on, on the rush. And Diaz gets that away. Incomplete pass. And now they come out with the Wildcat. Which this Wildcat is a bit too overpowered. CJ Spiller can't get the first down, only gain a five. Fourth down and two. And the Titans call a timeout. And Brett turned a punt. It's a fake! And Amon Hall keeping the ball! And he's got a first down to the 50. I don't particularly want to see that Broncos offense without a lead. Jeremy dies in the shotgun. Two wide receivers on each side. As he will take the snap. And Jerome Simpson with the catch. And a first down, I think. No, not quite. Second down in inches. I formation. And Chris Johnson got the first down, gain of six, and that will end off the first quarter. As a shotgun again for Jeremy Diaz. Four wide receiver set. And he will fire to Chris Johnson out of the backfield. Who's got it at the 23? For a 14 yard gain and a or a 15-yard gain and a first down on that play. Chris Johnson breaks a couple of tackles, gets gets um, six yards on that play. Split backs in the backfield for Jeremy Diaz. Ball at the Denver 16-yard line. As he's got Chris Johnson out of the backfield. As that will not be enough for a first down. Third down and two coming up. Can the Titans convert? I form. And Chris Johnson fights. And yes, he will get the first down. And I can chew more time off this clock now. 41 seconds to go in the first half, and he just got blown up in the backfield there. Second down and 13. High formation once again. A wide receiver on either side. And he will fire to Christian Sneed! Touchdown! Tennessee Titans! 14-yard pass play. And that's what execution is all about. Don't turn the ball over. Get first downs. Try to chew up clock. Just like the Broncos did in real life against the Chargers. Four minutes. And now I'm not letting them get a chance. A real good chance. And... Eddie Royal gets to the 21. He is the third string wide receiver. 
But now we shall see Carson Palmer and the Broncos. Yes, I did say Carson Palmer. He is no Sean Reno in the backfield. He will drop back to throw. And that's Brandon Lloyd. He has Brett Lloyd Royal as his wide receivers. And that's picked off! Off the tip! Did you see that? Look at this! Look at this! I'm like usering the safety right here, so... User pick! User pick! User pick! See, look! See, look, I was the safety watch! And because I'm hearing about these, the, the uh, Seahawks tip drills all the time. I come over there, hoping to make a tackle, and I make the user pick. Don't, don't test die user. That was actually a legit user pick. And die rolls out. That will be a first down at the 29. Time for one more play. And the Titans score! 29 yard run! I just thought I'd roll the dice since I had 9 seconds into the timeout. And this PAT is good. Yes. Although I don't make many interceptions because I suck at it, I finally get a user pick on camera and I finally get to say, legit, don't test a user. And that will be halftime. Alright, so, that pick really shifted the momentum, and Royal will take a knee in the end zone. <sighs> the Broncos will start at the 20. Diamond backfield for uh, Palmer. And Moreno with that carry. Six yards. Ball up to 26. They need a couple of scores. And he fires outside to Penny Britt. And Britt against his former team last time. Had two touchdowns. That's what they need right now. Palmer throws incomplete intended for Tony Scheffler. To be honest, to be honest, that first half couldn't have been any better. And no Sean Marino is blown up by uh Thornton. Yeah, it's someone. Setting up the wide receiver screen and he lost yardage! Fourth down! And Griffin the deep man. And he will be taken down at the 24. So let's see if Jeremy Diaz can put this game on ice. Diaz has Two wide receivers out to the left. Takes the snap. Rolls out of the pocket. Now fires it. 10 8 Washington incomplete. Second down and 10 coming up. I formation. Fake the gift to Chris Johnson. He is a wide open man in Boskate. 
gets it to the 45, and that will be the end of the third quarter with the score, Tennessee 14, Denver nothing. This game isn't as exciting, but but it's just one of those games where, where I have execution and the other team doesn't. It's picked off! I think that was Von Miller. Just as I say, I have perfect execution, and I get a... Get, or wait. Yeah, so... And Tony Scheffler, the tight end. Now this game gets a bit interesting. Single back in the backfield is Moreno. And Lloyd with the catch. Nine yards to the 25-yard line. To be honest, yes, I do think this team could make the playoffs. And Michael Griffin knocks it away from Eddie Royal. Third down in inches. Palmer back in the shotgun. He is 5 of 8 for only 32 yards. Takes the snap. Kenny Britt first down. They need to work quicker than this. Take a shot to the end zone. Take a shot. Take your shots. Palmer back to throw. To Royal. A minute to go and counting. Next week will be a monumental division game in the AFC South between the Titans and the Texans. Just going to preview that right now. And Eddie Royal. Catches that and keeps this a one score game. Yep, one score, seven points. One play. One play. I'm going to keep this interesting. This is what I did against Baltimore last season, and I still won the game. Yep, you see? The free safety dropped it! Whoa! I should stop jinxing myself. It's like... It's like, oh, perfect execution. Perfect execution. And then I throw a pick, it's like... There's a penalty, it'll probably be a face mask. Yep. Brandon Lloyd. And then I can... And then I talk about, oh well, I can get this onside kick with only two guys. And then the freaking safety coughs it up. Ugh. That safety's never playing again. If we lose. If we win, he might stay. Taking a shot deep! Kenny Britt! This is ironic. Ugh, the... Just the irony. Kenny Britt caught the... So what we thought, game-winning touchdown against us uh, back in the divisional round, or, or the game-time touchdown, and but 26 seconds to work. Do I go for overtime? Madden saying yes, but I'm just gonna say no with my three timeouts. Jeremy dies, empty back shotgun, five wide receiver set, steps up in the pocket, now unloads it. To Christian Sneed, and they call a timeout. Four wide receiver set. 
Only a three man front. They only bring those three. And that was so close to being picked off. Now you've got to take the deep shot. Take the deep shot. Four wide receivers spread the field. 11 seconds to go. And he will fire it. And two seconds. I'm just going to play for overtime right now. There's just no way I can score a touchdown right now. But maybe, maybe. Oh, God. One tackle away from ending it right there. Mother of God. Okay. Stop celebrating and knocking people down. Eerily similar game. I'm gonna roll the dice. Yes, I get it! I get it! No! Whoa! Yes! 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 I'm recording, man! Christian Sneed! Christian Sneed has a lane to the 31 yard line! I don't really trust myself to pass it here, so I'm just gonna run it. And I get nowhere. Jesus. Okay. Okay. Third down. Robert Meacham, first down at the 45. Empty back shotgun. Five wide receiver set. And he's taking a shot. Incomplete, intended for Christian's knee on that play. At the 45, I formation. And he goes around the outside, didn't get too far. Broncos defense keeps containing. Nate Washington, he just dropped it on his break right there. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, I'm doing this. Fake punt! Thank you very much. One play should end it right here. But then again, one play could screw me. Come on! Dang it! Oh my god. Yes! All of a chance at the game winner! From 33 yards out. And the kick is up. And it is good! And the Titans win in overtime. Very eerily similar to the, to the divisional round. But the Titans will have a shot at leading the AFC South next week. See you guys then.